Hollywood has released a whole bunch of horror movies so far in 2022. The horror genre is still fresh and will continue to be as long as the creative efforts are being put into the making. If you are a fan of watching horror inducing movies for fun, we bring you the top 10 horror movies released so far in 2022. Number 10, Orphan First Kill. Orphan First Kill is a psychological horror thriller film directed by William Brent Bell. After orchestrating a brilliant escape from a psychiatric facility she was being held in, Esther travels to America and poses as the missing daughter of a wealthy family. Orphan First Kill is a thrilling prequel to the original movie Orphan that got released in 2009. The evolution of an inexperienced younger version of Esther to the monster in Orphan is effectively portrayed without losing its intensity. The twist is unexpected and often first kill definitely lives up to the expectations it had before release. Number 9 Men Men is a folk horror film written and directed by Alex Garland. Harper retreats to the English countryside to escape from her past tragedy hoping to heal. But soon she was tormented by someone or something in the woods and it turns into a nightmare for her. Alex Garland's previous two films, Ex Machina and Annihilation, explores feminine trauma within the realm of science fiction. However, trauma remains the constant aspect even in men, but the horror elements infused with male toxicity are interesting to watch. Men is a primal, bold, and possibly unforgettable film that challenges you in almost every possible way. Number 8. Watcher Watcher is an American psychological horror thriller film written and directed by Chloe Okuno. As a serial killer walks the city, a young actress moves to town with her boyfriend. She starts noticing a strange man watching her from across the room who might be the local killer decapitating women. Watcher is a slow burn horror thriller that grabs your attention in a gritty manner. The movie leans its weight more on the psychological thriller side rather than a hardcore horror tale. Maika Monroe's powerful lead performance and well-maintained sense of suspense make Watcher a polished and engaging thriller. Number 7, Scream. Scream is a slasher film directed by Tyler Gillett and Matt Bettinelli Alpin. Set 25 years after a streak of murders in a small town Woodsboro, a new killer in town dons the ghost face mask and kills teenagers to resurrect the secrets of the town's deadly past. Scream or Scream 5 is the fifth installment of one of the most acclaimed horror franchises in Hollywood. Scream 5 is the only movie in the series not to be directed by the mastermind behind the franchise, Wes Craven, following his death in 2015. None of the sequels that got released after the first movie of the franchise could completely capture the essence of the slasher genre movies. Scream 5 has done a wonderful job in trying to match the captivating aspect of the first Scream. The movie has been received well by both the audiences and the critics. Number 6, Fresh Fresh is a black comedy horror thriller film directed by Mimi Cave. After getting frustrated with dating apps, Noah starts dating charming Steve, whom she met at a grocery store. Steve invites Noah to a romantic weekend getaway. It all goes well until Noah finds out her new partner is hiding some unusual appetites. The movie starts with a rom-com vibe and takes a turn into a horror thriller with some weird moments. The movie showcases dark comedy, horror elements, and gore torture moments at various points in this insanely made flick. We often get to see repetitive content when it comes to the horror genre. Fresh is mostly fresh in its treatment. Number 5. Nope. Nope is a science fiction horror film written, co-produced and directed by Jordan Peele. Two siblings find it hard to keep their family business afloat after their father died in a freak accident. They witness something sinister in the skies and must find a way to make use of the situation to save their horse ranch from failing. Acclaimed filmmaker Jordan Peele is back with another horror flick that questions our obsession with spectacles. The moral question raised by the movie might leave a huge impact on its viewers. The sci-fi genre is beautifully blended with the horror elements in this exhilarating ride that should not be missed by horror movie lovers. Number 4, The Black Phone. The Black Phone is a coming of age supernatural horror film directed by Scott Derrickson. A clever 13-year-old boy is abducted and locked in a basement by a masked maniac. He starts receiving phone calls from the murderer's previous victims on a disconnected phone attached to the wall. Whether he makes it out alive is the core plot of the movie. The Black Phone is the movie Scott Derrickson made after leaving MCU because of some creative differences with the Doctor Strange sequel. 
Some true edge of the seat moments blended with a stunning performance from Ethan Hawke as the grabber is the selling point of this movie. The black phone is simple, straightforward and it very effective. Number 3 X X is a slasher horror film written, directed, produced and edited by Ty West. Set in 1979, a group of young filmmakers set out to make a pornographic film in rural Texas. But soon they end up in a situation to fight for their lives when their host, an older couple, caught them in the act. The uncomfortable slow build-up handled by Ty West gives us every chance to imagine the mayhem that is about to happen. The movie dials up the retro vibe with some terrifying gory scenes. The exquisite cinematography and a great performance by Mia Goth take X to another level to get suspense under your skin in a convincing manner. Number 2. Barbarian Barbarian is a horror film written and directed by Zack Kreger. A young woman books a rental home as she travels to Detroit for a job interview. She finds out that the room is double booked and a young man is already staying there as a guest. She decides to spend her evening there and faces some horrible events. Director Zack Kreger takes up a deceptively single premise and turns it out into one of the most horrifying movies of the year. Barbarian offers a solid 100 minutes of jump scare, gritty narration and some unexpected twists and turns. Zack Kreger is always one step ahead of the audience in this perverse film that holds the audience glued to their seat for most of its runtime. Before we get on to the number 1 movie in our list, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like the video. Thank you for your support. Number 1. Pearl is a psychological slasher film directed by Ty West. Driven by the ambition to become a celebrity like how she has seen in the movies, Pearl finds her temptations and ambitions colliding while taking care of her ailing father under the supervision of her devout mother. Pearl is the origin story of the villain in one of the most acclaimed horror movies of the year, X. Mia Goth as Pearl is worth every award and accolade for a stunning and truly scary performance. Pearl works perfectly fine as a standalone film, but if you have watched X before, the cinematic experience is bloody remarkable. That's it from us today. We will meet you in another video with another interesting topic.